Okay. Really? The back door's open, guy. Why aren't you going in the back door? And there's another one. Back door's still open. But we're at the front. Hmm. Ready for your last day? Yeah. A freshman in high school? Yep. Sorry I'm late. My cat was sitting on me. <laughs> that t-shirt's appropriate, isn't it, TT? She's moved. She's thinking about it. Do you want to sit on him or not? Maybe. Good morning. Whew. I'm about ready for this week to be done. I'm getting a little bit sleepy around the edges because I've been staying up till after 10 to try to get caught up on everything. And then, you know, these friends are waking me up at 4.30. What? So, oh. yeah, and today, today's going to be a busy day because I have a retirement party to go to for my librarian friend who has been teaching and a librarian in our county for over 50 years. Like, I can't remember if it's 54 or 56, but wow, she's amazing. And then graduation at my high school. So it's gonna be another late night. But anyway, I've been trying to get caught up on this one this morning because Angie's finished and I am not. So yeah. Oh, and I'm wearing a cute t-shirt. I've been wearing cute t-shirts all week. Well, I wore school t-shirts Monday and Tuesday for my two schools. And I have a fun t-shirt planned for tomorrow. Makes me laugh to think about it. So anyway. I guess I better get to work, maybe? Maybe? Who am I kidding? I gotta put this back on the shelf and save it for maybe next fall. Okay, guys, I get to update my reading through the ages bingo. Finish that one. Oop, so I'm almost to make bingo Japan pre 1900. That's going to be The Thousand Autumns of Jacob de Zoet by David Mitchell. Oh, look at my new bookmark. I got this from Gabriel's librarian. She's retiring this year, too. Oh, all my favorites. Not, not all. Lee's still here. This is nice. Oh, and Miss Holloway. I love her, too. I love librarians. Anyway, these are neat chapter titles. Let's get started. Oh, my goodness. That opening chapter, though. <laughs> Whoa. Oh my goodness, the language in this book. By the by, for every 12 jewels or ducatunes sewn into a coat lining, 11 get seized at the sea gate and only a one slips through. They're best poked up your fig hole, and by the by, should your cavity eh, be so primed, Mr. Dizzy, I can get you the best price of all. <laughs> hey, babe. Hey, Mom. How was your day? Pretty good. Are you a big sophomore now? Yeah, almost in like a summer. Oh, mom, I'm forming the Roman Empire. Oh, yeah, it will be brought back to its former glory under Mussolini. I've defeated the English, I'm pushing into the Balkans, and I'm claiming my way through the Benny Lux. That's and exciting, then babe. I will have a unified Roman Empire. Mm. Good day. I noticed Kendra had a Reading Women Month bingo challenge on her booktube channel today, so I printed those out. I'm gonna, I think I'm gonna do, use my traveler's notebook this summer. So, yeah, I'm gonna put these in here. And I gotta decide how I wanna do it. Like, originally I was gonna try to see which ones I'd already done this year. And then just finish it. But now I think I might want to just start fresh just for the month of June and try to like fill out a different column each week and like really play bingo. I don't know. Decisions, decisions.
Guys, I hope you enjoyed that clip of my number one librarian, a precious, precious woman. Oh, Gabriel filmed the clip for me, and it's not the best. It was in a big retirement party room, but you know. And now I'm holed up in the teacher's lunchroom after hours. I've never been in here, um, but yeah. So I'm here for graduation at my high school. I have three boys graduating, and yeah. It's gonna be nostalgic because they're wearing my high school colors, so. Anyway, busy day. <laughs>